Hi and welcome to Mike Studios. Today we're sitting here with Burning Witches. My name is Saga. Uh, would you like to present yourself and say what you do in the band? I'm Lala, I'm the drummer. I'm Romana, I'm the guitar player. I'm Jay, I'm the bass player. I'm uh, Sonia, I play guitar too. I'm Laura, I'm singing. Huh. How did you get to know each other? Yeah, at first uh, Romana is uh, the one who is uh, the, the, the mastermind of this band. She has the, the dream of uh, having an all-female band. And then, um, yeah, I'm lacking up words. <laughs> Yeah, she, she formed a band and she she, she met, uh, she, she is together with her uh, old friend, Jay, our bass player. And then, yeah, after that, uh, they look for a singer. But unfortunately, she's not around anymore. That's why we have Laura. Yeah, then uh, they found me as a drummer. Then, um, um, yeah, and then we found Sonia, a great guitarist. Yeah. And then Laura, yeah, evil boys. Um, in which way did you learn to play your instrument? How did you practice? Um, personally, when I practice the guitar, I do it every day. And uh, before a show, uh, I try to uh, practice every day the set list of the, uh, that we are going to play at a certain show. And I have certain exercises that I have and I repeat at home. And also I really love playing just music that I really like, of yeah. musicians that I look up to. So that, that's really my passion. And honestly, when I practice, it's just a thing that I like to do. And how do you practice? I, uh, well, yeah, also, uh, like, yeah, the best thing is to do it every day a little bit, you know, especially if it's your voice, you can't, you just, you know, you can't go on for eight hours. I mean, I heard from some guitarists, I do it seriously, practice for eight hours, but with a voice, you shouldn't do that, you know, you just take it easy, practice every day, um, pff, maximum of an hour, I think, but, uh, like, yeah, if you can, do it every day. That's it, and then really, really do it with your full focus, you know, because you can just sing for fun, but if I, if I really want to learn something, I'm, I'm really focused on what am I doing, what should I be doing a little bit better, or, and why, you know, and what's happening here with, with the yeah. voice. So you, you, you have to know why something is working and why something isn't, and, and if you know that, you can uh, practice something way faster, you know. So yeah. that's how I do it. I try to understand it, yeah. What's... Uh, additional don't be uh, intimidated with the other people yeah because uh, everybody has their own talent and have their own skills so don't be afraid of that show it show what you got that's, yeah. the, that's the thing because everybody's different that's really nice Ed. what's your biggest inspiration when it comes to music uh, Judas Priest Iron Maiden sure yes okay do you, any of you have another inspiration? I have, uh, I'm a big fan of a guitarist named Tony McAlpine. Oh yeah. Yeah, his solos are so amazing. I can just dream about it. <laughs> so so good. Yeah. It's really cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah. For me too, like Judas Priest, Wasp, uh, With a Temptation. I also really like. I, I like lots of melodic metal. You know, almost all melodic metal. I think is awesome and. I take my inspiration from everywhere a little bit, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, um, <laughs> yeah. It, it um, for me it it doesn't matter what kind of influence you have. Yeah. It doesn't matter what kind of music where you started to because it will build you and the person yeah. you are right now. And then it's it will come and then you will decide what kind of uh, uh, music you want to be or you want to play yeah. someday. Yeah. It's good, no matter what kind of music. No matter jazz or some pop, it's music. Music is music. It's the yeah. best therapy yeah. ever. Yeah. <laughs> it's the best what there is. It's, it's, it's the best thing that there is in this world, is music. Yeah, yeah. really it is. And for my last question, I would like you to look into the camera and give the best advice you have for young and old musician, musicians trying to get to places like Sweden Rock oh. or other big stages. So you can Just look into one of the cameras here. And yeah, like you're saying it to them. Uh, one of them? Yeah, you can choose. Just uh, believe in yourself and uh, don't think something is impossible to reach. Because I was there too, I was thinking that something would be impossible. But 
if you really think that you can do this, you can actually do this and just follow your own feeling. If people bring you down, don't listen to them, just close your ears for that and do whatever you want in your own room and you will get there because if you think you can do it, you will definitely do this and I believe that you can do this, absolutely. Thank you so much. Yeah. It was really nice for you to come. Thank, Thank you. you.